Chapter 16 Will took some cloth and stretched the seams, but did not tear the thread, for there could be no separation. All was unified, including thought and body and spirit, inherited and pulsing through the blood. And he moved around his large west side apartment with great presence and ease. Nothing could be severed, and he took care with the principle behind it. And even when he opened his knife and touched the rippled steel and whittled the skin off a bit of pine, the cut did not sever, but gave beauty and infinity back to the broken ends of pine. And the carved pine dagger that was a girl on her toes with street smarts and resounding intellect and eyes that proclaimed I am the great and delicate creation you will never understand. He wanted to understand, though the mystery was the crucial and necessary interest and curiosity that drove him forward and attracted him to girls and girls to him. And at his best, he accepted the mystery. At his worst, he felt insulted, injustice, and more wronged. Her injustice was natural and inevitable and unfortunate, whereas wrong was a path chosen and meted out on innocence, free of fortune.